it's Mr. Nancy from Deck on here, and today we're going to be playing with a new chemistry set that we got from Mel Science. It's called Mel Chemistry, and I want to thank Mel Science a whole bunch for sending this to us to check out. I am really, really excited about it. I am too, actually. <laughs> it's actually really cool. So it's a monthly science kit um, that comes from Mel Science, just their Mel Chemistry kit. And they reached out to us not too long ago and, and asked if we'd like to check it out. And of course we said, yeah, we'd be happy to look at it. So they sent us something and I was yeah. pleasantly surprised. Like it's actually a really, really nice set of gear. Yeah. Right? I'm actually really loving it so far. We haven't done any experiments yet. This is going to be the first time. But I think it's going to be fun. Cooper, are uh -huh. you excited? Uh-huh. And, but oh, the only thing that we tried so far is this. Yeah. So it comes, we'll, we'll go over that. So this is the starter kit. So when you order the monthly kits, you get a starter kit first in the mail, right? And let's see what's in the starter kit. Okay, Puchan, you want to help explain a little bit? We have a manual. Manual? We have a periodic kit, the periodic table. A very, very nice periodic table. We have a tray, a general tray. Mm -hmm. We have, this is kind of cool. A beaker and funnel. And it's really nice, it's glass. Uh -huh. it's nice. Funnel? It's glass. Yep. We have photo. Uh, cups. disposable plastic cups and a singular graduated cylinder thing. And, and you can measure with this thing. Yeah, they both have measuring things. Yeah, they both have measuring. To what? Two safety goggles. Sorry, I don't want to talk about that. Compared to safety goggles. So one for Abba and one no, just one for you, I think. Yeah. Because Abba, your, your, because I have one and Abba have glasses. You got your little kid one. So I don't okay. think you we need one of them, but you might need one. What's this? Those are some plugs. Corks. Corks. Some of them Corks. have holes in them, some of them don't. Ooh, know depending on the experiments. Um, this little guy's pretty cool. Cork. That what is, is this? A, uh, what are those called? Macro. Yeah, macro lens. It's a macro lens for your phone, so you clip it over your phone camera so you can take really close up pictures of the chemistry that you're doing. That's mm -hmm. pretty cool. Uh, it has this guy. Which is a syringe. Syringe. It has this guy. Which is a phone stand. It's a little phone stand because they have a phone app that's really nice that's called yes. uh, Mel Science. And so you go. Oh, uh, what is the thing right here here that I was talking about earlier? Yeah, hold on one sec. So it's got a really cool phone app that has, you can go find the experiment that you're doing and it has all the instructions. And you can put that on the phone stand so you can watch it. And it also comes with this, which is what? A VR gear. What's that, Cooper? VR. VR, because the phone app Box. actually has little VR uh, versions of the molecules that Box. you're playing around with. So you can get in here and look at a 3D model of the molecule but, you're playing but around with. But this time, it's box style. It's box style? Yeah, it's like a Google Cardboard. It is right? Google Cardboard. Yeah, uh, it branded is. branded Google Cardboard. And then this is my it's favorite thing. Google Cardboard. This is what makes it legit. Ooh. What's this, Ava? That is a burner. It's a burner. It's like a little stove that we will use to do and it has these little uh, cork boards that you put down so that you don't burn your table and then you'll actually do a lot of, because you know chemistry requires heat a lot of times and so this is where you'll do the heat and that's right we have some, we're providing our own matches. All right, so that, and this is part of the burner. I think that's everything we got in the, in the starter kit. What is the bag for? This is where the little macro lens thing is. we're good. Cool? All right, so this is what you get in the starter kit. And then every month you get two experiment packs. Uh -huh. Two weeks. Two weeks a month. Two a month. And then so I said you can do one every two weeks. And they, they're supposed to take, each one comes with two experiments, I think. And each experiment lasts less than an hour, is the idea. Mm -hmm. So they're like a family kind of on Sunday, like we're doing right now. You just chill out and you can knock out one and of these the experiments one, that we're about to do. And the one that we're going to do first is this one. That we're going to do this guy, which is Monster Chemistry of Monsters. And we're going to do the sugar snake, yeah. which is kind of like the little black snake kind of fireworks that used to be around. Oh, when I, was I know kid. how we do that. Do you? Uh -huh. Okay. Probably See, not this way. Then all the ashes you put, and then you put it on a on a plate, lay, and then you burn it, and then it turns into a black snake. Not precisely, but we're going to do something like that. All right. <laughs> so here, let's, let's look at one of these. So the month, we'll clean all this stuff up before we do the experiment, just to show you what a what, what a monthly kit looks like so again some some instructions it comes with a card for each experiment and i actually kind of love this because this has the actual chemical reaction of the experiment that you're about to do so you can see the chemical reaction on the back are little ikea instructions for how to do the experiment which <laughs> is, is always the, welcome and this is this one no no there are two in this one and there are two in that one. So there's a different burning, a sh making sugar burn in this one. We'll do that one later. Uh, it comes with all the little reagents that you need. Uh -huh. Three packs. 
three packs, so you can do like three times. This one, this one comes from a uh, little, uh, yeah, you'll see how this works. But all the, all the equipment you need to do this experiment, other than like in this one, we need to add our own sugar a little bit and we got the matches to burn it. And right? I guess a stick? A, st a little stir stick of some sort is in there. Yeah. It looks like these, it has these little stickers and it says the first thing you do is you put the stickers on the things that get hot. So I think the stickers may actually change when they're hot. So you can tell, yeah, you can tell when it's hot. So we're gonna go through and start putting together a little burner and follow the instructions and get ready to do the sugar snake experiment mm -hmm. here. Okay? okay? Let's do that. How about we montage that? Ooh, montage. So I love the little heat sensitive sticker because it did change. So now it shows like a little heat sign. No touchy. No touchy. It lets us know that this thing heated up in case you didn't know that's what happened to metal when you set it on fire. <laughs> uh, but it tells you how long it's hot. So if, when it's cooling off, it lets you know how long to wait before you touch anything or play with a snake. So it like goes off it'll when turn the fire black. goes out? Well, when the fire goes out, it'll still be hot for a little while. And you wait until that turns black before it's cool enough to maybe touch. Okay? Mm. Presley, what do you think? It's really cool. It's pretty amazing, huh? Like, this is a really like awesome while, chemistry kit. Like, while I was right here in the piece, I was like, <laughs> I'm just doing that. <laughs> your mouth was open, your jaw dropped. It was so cool. It's pretty cool. All right, so let's talk real quick about chemistry here. Um, so this is sugar, which if you burn sugar completely, it burns into uh, carbon dioxide gas and water, right? But it's too low. H2O, that's exactly right, water is H2O. But it needs an injection of oxygen. So when things burn, they need oxygen to burn, right? Yeah. And if you don't put enough oxygen in there, then like, what's carbon dioxide? Carbon dioxide? Uh -huh. What's the chemical? A one carbon and two oxygen? Yeah, but what's that called? Well, how do you, oh. another way to say that? Um, another way to say that would be um, carbon dioxide. C? CO2. CO2. Yeah. CO2. Like, so it's you get a carbon and you put two oxygens on it, it makes carbon dioxide yes. gas, and that's what makes this kind of fluff up actually is the carbon dioxide gas that actually comes from the little crucible thing that we're the solid fuel that we built. Yeah. I don't think that comes out of the reaction. But so that makes CO2, a CO2 gas and H2O, which is water, and that could be water vapor that floats away yeah. too, right? But if there's not if you don't inject enough oxygen, so if you get CO2 if you put two oxygens in, what do you get if you don't put those two oxygens in? If you don't have CO2 you just get carbon. You just get carbon, right? And what color is carbon? Carbon is black. Carbon's black. So that is the carbon that comes from the incomplete burning of sugar, which I'm sure is explained in all of the stuff we haven't looked at. We haven't watched the video yet, and we haven't looked at all of that. I looked a little bit at the chemical reaction and some of the stuff that's going on. And so like car in our snattles, so Cooper, we're, what we're going to do is we're going to take our snattles and we're going to build what just happened here, oh. right? And show what happened at the molecular level. Uh -huh. But what happened was we ended up with carbon, which this is all just carbon. So can you tell me, in the snatoms or in the molecule kits that we play around with, what color are the carbon balls? The carbon what? Black. Black. That's because carbon's black. So they usually make them black. Right? Mm -hmm. So that's pretty cool. Yeah? Mm -hmm. So we have on the card. Can I go get the snap? No, we won't do it right this second. But like if you look here, so you're starting with sugar and you know with 12 carbons and 11 waters. Right? And so the carbons. <laughs> The carbon is what makes this turn black like this, and then the carbon dioxide that I think comes out of the fuel that burnt fluffs it up and makes it fluffy like carbon dioxide does. It kind of puff, makes air bubbles and things, right? And and I saw it was I saw it was it was burning because I said it was black because it was burning. 
Oh, yeah, and sometimes, yeah, carbon, when carbon doesn't burn completely, you end up with black, right? That's a lot of times when you see black on stuff that burned, it's carbon that didn't burn completely. Uh, so, yeah, this is, like, I could not be happier yeah, with this as a kid. Cool. And this is just one, so every, you get two, I think you get one of these boxes every, I can't remember now. I have to look. Yeah, two you know, there's going to be a link in the description to how it all works. I don't remember how many, I think maybe one of these boxes comes every two weeks. And that comes with two experiments in it. So there's another Great. sugar burning one. And then we have this really cool, like, build a hedgehog. Uh, this is I 10. Build a hedgehog. So you're playing with that little guy So if you're playing around with 10 and this one, uh, it comes with all the equipment you need. It's nice that it has a little burner. Mm -hmm. It's the phone app, has videos that explain how everything works. You can use the 3D. Mm -hmm. Cooper looked at the 3D thing and looked at the molecules. So Cooper today was just taking the, the little cardboard thing. And I put my phone in it and he would go through and you can look at the experiments and it tells you the details of the experiments or you can just look at the molecules. And so he would look at a molecule and then he would go get our Snatums kit and build that molecule and come back and show us that he built the molecule, right? And that was fun too, wasn't it? Uh -huh. Yeah. So we've been having a lot of fun with this already. Mm -hmm. And I think this is going to be a particularly can awesome I, little science so kit. So should I show them this? Do you want to show how it works? Yeah, so I'll get it off the first. Can we get it off? Let me do. So here you can see it doing the 3D thing. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, it doesn't look, doesn't look like much when it's on the phone, but if you pop it in here. Ooh. Oh, that's so cool. Ooh, is that rotate my head? It rotates. That's kind of weird. Yeah, that's what it's supposed to do. I know, but it's a little. I feel like I should be able to like, walk around if I get a blind. Like Cooper, look. Oh, it's black, so I can touch it. Not yet. Not yet. Uh -huh. I'm still warm, but not. We have done this one already. Ready. Yep, okay. You ready? Let's get back to the experiment. Yes, All right, so that was going So now, Pujan wants to use a stick to poke. Do so I use the... This poke. This stir stick thing. No, I want to like poke. It poke. Oh, you just want to poke a hole? Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. No, don't poke a hole. I'm going to touch it. Okay, touch it first. Touch it very, very gently. Oh, that's good. Wow. <laughs> not gently at all. Very, very gently. Okay, it's like ash. Right, okay, you can poke it now, Pucha. It's ash. Okay, now watch. I thought it would have more of a Cheeto like texture. Oh, a it's Cheeto just, it's texture? Just, it's fluffy carbon. Right. I mean, it's, it's ash. Wow. Don't poke me. <laughs> I'm being very gentle with it. So, why is it so fluffy, Pucha? Because there is carbon dioxide. Carbon dioxide, yes, makes it lovely. Wow. Oh, no, it's it's really amazing. Yeah. Like kudos. Thank you very much to Bell Science. Uh, yes. There'll be a link in the description where you can go order the kit and get started getting the monthly kits. I think we may start getting the monthly kits because I think they're yes. fantastic. Yeah. This is one of the coolest like chemistry things. So one of the things I was going to talk about too, Cooper. Listen to this. Put that down. So this is a really interesting thing, right? So if you take like a Coke can, or I think a piece of paper. What, what was I looking about? You take a piece of paper and you crumble it up into a little ball, uh -huh. right? You're changing it. Like, like you're trying to fold it away. Like you're not going to throw it away. Yeah, you just crumble it up into a ball. So you're changing it, right? But you're just making a physical change. You're changing the shape. But it's still paper. It's still made of the same thing, right? It's always the same. But when you do a chemical change like this, you're taking like one thing or two different things and you're changing what it is. Like that's not sugar anymore. Like when we, we put sugar in there and then we burned it and it became carbon and water, right? Mm -hmm. I, that's pretty cool. Like yeah. we turned it into something else Magic. by with using heat. Is that cool? Yeah. Yeah. I, and so, like a little soap. Be really careful. It's like a little stuff. Yeah. So that's what for like you know thousands and thousands exactly of years what it is. people have been trying to turn different things into gold. Alchemy. Alchemy, right? Uh, so people are trying to to make gold. Mm. So they're trying to get alchemy. Alchemy is turning things, yeah, but turning things into gold. So they, they haven't been able to do it. But just the idea that it's a chemical change, so we actually changed what was in the container, is pretty cool, yeah? We didn't just change its shape or something, we actually changed what it is. Yeah. That's kind of like magic, isn't it? Uh -huh. Yeah, science magic. So I, I love it. Pujan, thumbs yeah. up. Cooper, uh -huh. thumbs up, thumbs uh -huh. down. Big thumbs up. Super Cooper, thumbs up. Eh, 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 don't touch. Maybe, even though it's like, no, it's actually just kind of a little bit warm. Yeah, I love it. I think it's fantastic. Thank you guys so much for sending us the kit, right? Awesome. You want to get us out of here? Let's see the second. Oh, we will also, we're going to do a much bigger, wow. like, uh, uh, unboxing and talk about this in a lot more detail over on Bite Sized. Yes. So if you want to watch some of the Bite Sized stuff and see a bigger yeah. breakdown of the science and things behind these, then, then go watch over there. Crazy. Is it crazy? One of the things I wanted to mention is that these come with these really amazing photographs. Like, this is the snake. 
Oh, really? So see it's burning at the bottom and the carbon's kind of rising That's up so and cool. stuff. So it's a really amazing photograph. And you may be able to That's use so like the macro lens to take pictures even with your phone and guys. So we're going to try and take some really nice photos of this, this thing well, happening too. That's a picture of it? Yes, I, mean, so I thought that was a volcano. I know, it looks like a mountain or a volcano or something, but you can see here's where it's burning and here's the snake coming up out of it. Mm -hmm. So really beautiful high resolution yeah. photos of what's going on. Like, I, just love, I just love that. Like a lot of attention to detail went into this thing. Well, it's kind of big. It is kind of big. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. Presley, get us out of here. Make sure to press the subscribe button if you want to see more experiments like this. And if you want to see us do the 10 experiments or do the other experiment in this kit, make sure to let us know in the comments below. So yeah, thank you for watching and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Bye.